Hi, I'm Jerome Fong, and I'm a member of the Stewardship Committee and the Vestry here at St. John's Episcopal Church in Ithaca. Last Sunday, I was struck by something Mother Megan mentioned in her sermon. Quote, Every time we reach out in love, God enters into our midst and transforms our moments of pain and suffering into something new and something resurrected. End quote. During these difficult times, one way we can reach out in love is to be intentional about sharing the gifts of time, talent, and treasure that God has given us. Viewed in this light, something as simple as calling to check up on a neighbor isn't just something nice. Rather, when we're mindful of how God can act through us, that phone call can become something holy, something that makes God present, even in spite of physical distance. Likewise, giving generously of our earthly resources as we are able, when done with intention, can also be a way to reach out in love. For me, there have been plenty of Sundays when filling out an envelope seems like just another thing to be done. But lately, I've been reflecting on how the act of giving intentionally is not only a way to give back to God what comes from God, for indeed, all things come of thee, O Lord, and of thine own have we given thee. But it is also an act of love that enables the church to make God known to the world. Right now, for instance, your support is enabling St. John's to find new and creative ways to share God's love online with people who may never have worshipped with us before. The needs of the world, our local community, and our parish family here at St. John's continue to be great. We thank you for your prayers and for your ongoing support. This week, might there be a way in which you can intentionally share your time, talents, or treasure as a way of reaching out in love? Thank you, and God bless you.